right, ladies, what do you all know about men? Men want to change. Change? Yeah. It's something what men don't have to go through. But men... There's a reason it's been given to women, because we can cope. Sorry, man in the room. <laughs> I'm here to be abused, it's fine. <laughs> This is the award-winning Café Leap in Leeds. It's run for and by people with learning disabilities. But this session is to help women prepare and go through the change. Feeling sad and tearful, depressed, forgetting things, and you can get angry. You'll get, you'll get quite tearful sometimes, don't you? But you've got lots of support here. Lay one on me, sister. Should we do a group hug? Group hug. Well, it's something, Susan, every woman sat on this table is going to go through yeah. the My name is Susan Hanley and I am 54 year old and I'm going through the menopause. Susan is the chair of Cafe Leap and has had a tough time coping with some of the worst of the symptoms. I'm buying, what do you fancy? But this is where she comes for advice, support Perfect. and <gasps> essential It's going to be good. <laughs> a woman needs a cake. Nice. Not bad. Because Becky told me you were a bit scared at first. I was a bit scared. I wasn't sure what I was going through. You wasn't sure what's happening? I could get really low. But I try and pick up myself. That's all you can do, really. <laughs> The Down Syndrome Society tell us too many women like Susan get late diagnosis and delayed support because symptoms are too often missed by GPs. Susan with Down Syndrome, they tend to go through the menopause earlier than the majority. So obviously the majority, they tend to say is 50 plus, don't they? Whereas with, with Down Syndrome, it can be in your early 40s. So that's <laughs> and there's another reason symptoms can be missed too. It's called diagnostic overshadowing. Often that is when someone's class is having a challenging behaviour, for example, or they're having an emotional outburst. So GPs or medical professionals will miss an underlying medical problem because they just haven't taken the time to see beyond the learning disability. Yeah, for some reason it never seems to get picked up as menopause. Please, doctors and nurses, whatever, please help us. Don't use wrong words, don't talk, jargon. Us ladies need to get for it to keep, keep going. Don't hold it in, get it all out at your system and it feel great in yourself. One third of women will fly through the menopause, one third will manage the symptoms, but another third will find it hard. And women with learning difficulties might need that bit extra help making sense of what is happening. Jane McCubbin, BBC News.